Hey there, today I'm gonna to show you a heel locking technique that's gonna leave your foot to be more secure in your sneaker when you run or do other activities or sports or whatever, okay? What you'll notice is that most good shoes are going to have an extra hole at the top, okay? This is towards your ankle and it doesn't go up anymore, it just comes closer to the ankle. So what we actually wanna do, instead of crossing the lace back over to the other side, we're gonna show you this heel locking technique. So what I'm gonna do, when I finish, instead of coming across, when I get to the top, I'm actually gonna take that same side loop and we're gonna put it through, through that hole, okay? And it creates this nice big loop here. I already did it on the other side. And then what you're gonna do is take that lace and put it through the opposite loop. So I'm gonna do the same thing over onto this side, okay? And what this is going to do is create a really nice locking mechanism for the heel. So let me show you on my foot. So once I get to this position, I'm just gonna lift up and then I'm gonna separate. Here I have a little extra space, so I'm gonna do that a second time. And what that's doing is pulling my ankle in and locking my heel into the actual heel cup. Then I'm gonna tie it how I normally would and now that heel is not moving at all, but it gives good expansion for my actual uh, metatarsals to be able to move around in that forefoot, okay? If I just do my regular tying mechanism on the other side, what happens is we end up getting a really big looseness of my ankle coming forward, so it doesn't feel as secure. So when I'm running, here I get, I, there's actually no movement here where on that right side, I can feel it's just a little too, a little loose. So that's your heel locking technique. Use it, give it a try, and uh, we'll see you next time.